So, there's no girls going to go to loo now, are they? <laughs> I'm so sorry. Oh, God, they're all going to be out there fucking going, oh, she got in! Rather go to the toilet and watch my show, would you? Fuck off. I should stand here now like that. <laughs> so, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> let's push together, Barbara. <laughs> so, so <laughs> later, oh, I'm fucking sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> so yeah, I was uh, on my way uh, out from Wales, and uh, my first time in Wales, I had a bit of an accident. I'll catch my car. Can I have a big R? Oh. I went straight to the back of the car in front and the driver got out, this little dwarf fella and he came around to the back of the car and he went I'm not happy I said, which one are you then? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to tell them account of them, they're very clever lads John and Edward became Jedward They should have been called Pete and Rick <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, anyway and, uh, <laughs> Have we got any fans of Elvis Presley in the room tonight, ladies and gentlemen? Any Elvis fans in? <laughs> Does anybody fancy a bit of Elvis? Grab a shovel, follow me. Let's go. And, uh, I said, Joe, I'm actually a very big Elvis fan. We actually called our dog Elvis, yeah. Because if you go near his food bowl, he does that with his top lip. <laughs> There's a great impression of Elvis if you tickle his belly. You tickle my dog's belly and he goes ah. Weird. Freaks me out. <laughs>